Di qua va. Tutte cose buone, tutto a posto? Sì. Eh. Risotto stasera qua. Sì. Roasted chicken and Asiago cheese risotto. Take that Mario Batali, I want to see you make it that good. At Chino's Grill on the University of Connecticut's campus, the coach's storied career has provided him with celebrity status. I love this coach. He does an awesome job. This is a great place, and we're lucky to have him. And you know why we have to be really good friends? Because I'm the police chief. She's a... <laughs> <laughs> and although Oriema has a prominent place amongst Yukon Nation today, his career in stores was set in motion ever so modestly in 1985. We drove down to a Dunkin' Donuts, me and John Toner, the AD. We sat down and he asked me if I wanted to be the coach. I said, sure. And uh, he said, you promise not to screw it up? I said, I'll do my best. And he came back here, they handed me a piece of paper, said, you're the coach at the University of Connecticut. Sign here. That was it. Done. And um, so far, so good. Eight NCAA titles later, Oriema's drive has shifted from what it once was. I think until we won our first national championship, there's this feeling like I got to prove that I can do it. But if you do two, if you win two national championships, that's, that's more than just luck. And if you can win three, then that's pretty significant. And four, like, wow, now you're like starting to get into territory that very few people have been in. So once it got to that point, it was, it's not about that anymore. Yo, come on, Mo. Get that. Get it, get it. Now, when I interviewed here, I asked him, what is it that motivates you to continue to do this? Because he's won eight national championships. He's done the Olympics. He's done everything they could possibly do. And he said, each young lady who walks through this door as a freshman has never had the opportunity to earn and win a national championship. And that's what motivates me, getting them at least one while they're here. I remember last year on senior night talking with Kelly Farris and I said, listen, I'm gonna try really, really hard and do everything I can to make sure this ends the right way for you. So when you actually see the clock go zero, 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 and you want a national championship and you look on Kelly Farris's face, that's why you do it. That's why you do it. As Oriema continues to seek new motivation, the question still lingers. How long will he stay? When I got the job at Connecticut, I said, you know what? Four years, I'm out of here. Like, I can't envision me being here more than four years. It's just not going to work. There's just not enough here to make it happen. So that, obviously that plan didn't work. So I'm not a plan guy. Just trying to be good at what I do. And where that leads me, I don't know. Whatever happens, happens.